What is up you guys? This is LEGO Superheroes today. And today, I'm going to show you how to build a better Groot from Avengers Infinity War. Now, I gotta be honest you guys, you guys have begged and pleaded in the comment sections of past Build a Better videos to create a teenage Groot, and I honestly wasn't sure what to do with this figure. Um, you know, we don't really have very many arms that have brown printing, and even the ones that are out there don't really work for Groot in my opinion, so I just made a couple little minor upgrades, and then I have one at the end that I have to switch out to show you. So the arms, torso, and head are all the same as the regular teenage Groot, so that's easy. And of course, you've got this little tree branch that he holds, that's fine too. I recommend adding a cell phone or a video game device of some sort. I know that one of the collectible minifigure guys had a game controller at one point, but I like this cell phone. I just think that it kind of looks like a game, and I think that that works for him. Um, this phone has been in a lot of sets. It's been in Friends sets. I mean, I could list a lot of sets that it's been in and places it's appeared, so just the blue cell phone will do. And then the other change that I made are the legs down here. As you can see, there's a little bit of shading on the front of those, uh, on the feet, really. And where that comes from is the collectible minifigure series party guy who was in the horse costume. So that's supposed to look like his horse feet. Another idea that I had was to take a Wookiee I, either Chewbacca or like, you know, the Wookiee gunman or something like that and use those legs because as you can see here, there's a little bit of fur on those brown legs, so it gives a little bit of texture there. Um, I just prefer the, these little uh, shading on the feet, honestly. So, like I said, there's not a ton to do, but I do have one other recommendation, and that's to take the keychain Groot and remove the keychain from his head. Now, if you guys will remember, if you scroll back a few videos uh, from right now, you'll see that I did a tutorial on how to remove the keychain from this Groot. And when you do that, you can pull his head off, and then you can switch the heads. And I really like this angry face that Groot is making um, from the keychain head. So that gives you just a little bit of customization that you can do with this figure. So let me know what you guys think. Again, I know that you guys were really excited to see a Teenage Groot upgrade, and I'm always excited to deliver for you guys and give you exactly what you want. But unfortunately, I don't really know what we could do with Teen Groot other than what I just did. So I'm really going to look forward to reading your comments on this one to see what ideas you guys have for building a better Teen Groot. So leave a comment below letting me know what you think about Teen Groot and what suggestions you have for building a better Groot. Also, let me know what other characters you guys want to see me do build a better versions of, and I'll look forward to reading all of those comments down below. If you liked what you saw and you liked what you heard, feel free to click that subscribe button for more LEGO content coming in the near future. This has been an official transmission by LEGO Superheroes Today, and as always, build on.